The Quran says, you are busy piling up, calculating, developing your careers, your money, your occupation, your wealth, until you visit the graves. Think about it. When was the last time that you went to a funeral? Was it your mother? Was it your father? Was it your grandfather? Was it your uncle? Was it your cousin? Was it your friend? Was it your wife? Was it your husband? The last time that you visited the grave, when you went to a funeral and you saw that person whom you love that was laughing, crying, live, boasting, wealthy, educated, denying, arrogant, whatever they were. What was the demeanor? Were the people cracking jokes? Were they dancing? Were they clapping and singing songs? No. Silence. Why? Because every person that walked in that room, seeing that person stretched out, the first thing they thought about was that one day, this will be me. So Allah said, all of us, all of you are engaged in running your mouths, doing your business, multiplying, buying houses, cars, business, whatever you're doing. And when you're told about God, religion, life, morality, you're saying, look, I ain't got no time for that. I don't want to hear that. I don't even believe in God. See how arrogant people can be until they visit the funeral house. And you say to yourself, is that it? I mean, 50, 60 years, scraping, struggling, scheming, lying, stealing, fornicating, jumping up and down, begging, working, and this is the end of it? So it really means that after all this time, and the people walk away from that grave, it's over.